I've always had the biggest crush on you. Please be in a relationship with me. Um, sorry, I can't. What? Why not, Yuri Chen? Tell me the reason why. I already like someone else. Someone else? I didn't know you liked someone. Who is it? Kamioka. He's a year younger than us. I'll probably agree to date you if you look a little more like Kamioka-kun. Okay then. Bye. Who in the world is Kamioka? Kamioka, the fifth grader, is known as the most handsome guy in our school. He's even popular with the sixth grade girls. I heard he even has a fan club. What? As a fifth grader? I can't believe he even has a fan club. Ugh. I can't believe all the girls are giving him that kind of attention. I want to make that Kamioka dude pay. I got an idea. I have a plan that can mess up his handsome face. Hey, are you Iki Kamioka? Yeah. I heard you're having problems with acne. We'll teach you how you can fix that. Follow us. I am having problems with it, but we won't do anything scary. Come on, let's go. Okay. Hey, dude. How many girls have confessed their feelings for you? Um, huh? You can't even remember how many right away? Hey, pimples get bigger when there is buildup of oil. Did you know that? Um, answer us! Answer us! Yes! That's why the best way to fix your acne is to pop your pimples using a needle. No, that's so scary. Ah! My name is Nico. I'm a level A maid for the head of the internationally recognized company, the Moroboshi Corporation. Moroboshi-sama. I live at the Moroboshi Mansion and see Moroboshi-sama every single day. But I was so surprised when I looked at myself in the mirror today. <gasps> You're kidding me. I have a huge pimple here. Oh, maybe I have too many snacks. Oh, ouch. Oh, it's huge and it even hurts. This might be the worst pimple I've ever had. Thank goodness because Moroboshi-sama was out on a trip and was at home at the moment. Uh, I have to make this pimple go away before Mr. Marboshi comes home. Uh, if I go to the dermatology department at the Marboshi Corporation's Marboshi General Hospital, they should be able to fix it. I was on my way when I saw a young boy looking sad in the middle of the road. Uh, what happened to your face? My acne got worse. It looks like it really hurts. I'm actually on the way to the dermatologist. Do you want to come with me? Really? But I don't have any money. You don't need to worry about the money. Let's go. This is the popular Moroboshi General Hospital. My name is Nico. What's yours? My name is Iki Kamioka. I'm a fifth grader. Iki-kun? Is this your first time coming to this hospital? Yes, it's my first time at a hospital this big. I'm kind of nervous. They won't do anything to you that hurts. So don't worry. Just put on the creams and drink the medicine that they prescribed to you. And it'll get better right away. Will it actually get better? My acne is pretty terrible. Ouch! Ah, uh, yeah! We popped them all! <laughs> you better be thankful! Yashida-san fixed your acne! Say thank you! Thank you. Ikikamioka-sama, please enter the examination room. Yes. Ikikun, I'll see you later. Nice to meet you. My name is Rhea from the dermatology department. Nice to meet you too. Yes. She's a female doctor. Oh, gosh. Your acne got very bad, didn't it? Look what happened to your handsome face. Will she get mad at me? Poor guy. Did you touch your face and pop your pimples because it was bothering you? Yeah, she said that nicely. She came over to examine my face. She smells really good. Yes, I popped it because I was bothered. <laughs> I get how that feels. I can't help but touch it sometimes, too. But the more you touch your face, the more bacteria will get on your pimples. That's how it flares up and starts hurting. So try not to touch it from now on, okay? Yes. She's such a nice doctor. I'm going to prescribe you some pills and a cream. So don't forget about taking and using them as indicated. Yes, ma'am. Is the examination over already? Hopefully, you don't get any scarring from this. I want to get a follow-up on how your acne is doing. So come back next week. And also... Come by if you have anything else you want to ask me. Yes, thank you so much. She must be a great doctor. She really seems like she's worried about me. It's been a week. Let's see how your acne is doing. Okay. There's still a bit of redness right now, but it looks pretty good. It's all because of your help, doctor. No, it's because you worked hard, Ikikun. Thank goodness. I was being sad about my acne in the park, but Nikosan came up to me and offered to pay the medical bill. So I wanted to get it better as soon as possible. Huh? 
Nico-chan's paying your bill? What about your parents? We're poor. They wouldn't be able to afford to treat my acne. I see. Did you come here alone today? Yes. My appointments are ending soon, so I'll bring you home. What? It's okay. I could go home on my own. Don't be shy. It seems my house is close by, too. You're just on the way. It's fine, okay? Dr. Rhea dropped me home that day. Is this the right place? Yes, thank you so much for dropping me home. Your lights are off. No one's home? My dad is always late because of work. What about your dinner? I'm gonna buy at the convenience store like always. That's not good for your skin. Dr. Rhea will make you dinner. But, Dr. Rhea, aren't you tired after your work? I'm fine. Or should I mind my own business? No, oh, that would actually make me really happy. Dr. Rhea made me a delicious dinner from the ingredients I had at home. This is so delicious! I haven't had dinner this good in a long time! After I said that, I dived back into my meal. Your mom is busy at work too? My mom passed away right after I was born. Oh, I'm sorry. So it's just you and your father then? Yeah, we weren't poor in the past. But Dad's such a good person, he became his friend's guarantor and ended up having to be responsible for a large loan. That's why he works all day and only comes home late at night. I see. It must be very hard for you. After a while, Dad came home. Iki, I'm home! Oh, do we have a guest? M my name is Rhea. I'm Iki Kun's dermatologist. I know I probably should have minded my own business and not meddled, but I came in to cook his dinner for him. What? No, actually, I'm sorry for making you do all of that. We also made some for you, so please eat. Oh gosh, I was actually starving. Thank you so much. Dr. Rhea's cooking is amazing, you know? Come on, Ikikun. You're not going to get anything from flattering me. It's delicious. It's been a long time since I've had dinner that's this good. Dad also swallowed down his food just like I did after saying that. See? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed it. We had a wonderful dinner thanks to Dr. Rhea. This is a gift for you. Thank you for always helping me with my skin. Oh, Nico-chan, thank you so much. I heard you took care of Ikikun after we came here together. That's a relief. Yeah, I couldn't just leave him alone. I go over to his place sometimes to make him dinner. I see! You guys are close friends already! Well, for me, it's more like... I want to get closer to Ikikun's dad. The way his eyes crinkle and they smile is so cute. And makes my heart flutter. The way he can't do anything by himself is cute, too. Oh, yeah. I was going to invite him on a picnic sometime soon. Will you come with? We can invite Moroboshi-sama, too. That's a great idea. I'll ask Moroboshi-sama. Moroboshi-sama? Like, THE Moroboshi-sama from the Moroboshi Corporation? They're all great people, so don't worry too much. Anyways, I worked hard to make these bento boxes. So let's enjoy it. Wow, this looks amazing. Oh, Nico-chan and Moroboshi-sama are here. Hey guys, over here. Sorry about the wait. I'm so excited about today. Me too. It's really Moroboshi-sama. Hey, isn't that Kamioka? Oh yeah, it is. And Dr. Rhea's there too. Dr. Rhea and the lady with the pink hair? They're both so hot. Not the lady in the pink. She's a dermatologist at the Moroboshi General Hospital. She's been my doctor before. She's really nice and smells really sweet. Why is she with Kamioka? I think Kamioka went to that doctor because of his acne. <laughs> That's probably it. We popped Kamioka's pimples and that led them to me. Maybe she'll feel sorry for us and be nice to us if we pop our pimples too. Definitely, she has to. Let's pop our pimples so that the doctor can be nice to us. Maybe if we go big and put chili peppers on it, it'll get really red and she'll feel even sorrier for us. That's a good idea. Let's do it. Ah! Are you guys stupid? You popped your pimples and put chili peppers on them? This is going to leave a scar. Doctor, it hurts. Please be nice to us. Doctor, please treat our pimples nicely because we're just miserable kids. Be nice to us like how you were to Iki when we popped his pimples and take us on a picnic. Stupid, don't say that. You're joking. You guys were the one that popped Iki Kun's pimples? We thought it would help him heal faster. Yeah, yeah, we heard it from someone. Yeah. There's no way your acne will get better like that. I'm going to make you guys go through a painful treatment. Ah! So basically, I made sure they learned their lesson. So don't worry, Ikigun. I informed their parents about what happened. 
So I think they should be here to apologize sometime tomorrow. Thank you, Dr. Rhea. I love you. You don't need to call me that. Just call me Rhea. I'm home. Smells good in here today. Dad, welcome home. You've been coming home early recently. I don't have any more debt. It's all thanks to the lawyer that Rhea-san introduced me to. I'm glad things went well. I just finished up cooking dinner, so let's all eat together. Yay! I'm so happy that we've been eating delicious dinners every day. That's true. I'd be so happy if this continues from now on. I wonder if things went well for Dr. Rhea. She already won Ikikun and his dad over with food. I think it's just a matter of time now. I hope that's true. I'm glad your pimples got better too, Nico. How did you get that picture? I get notifications when you and the other maids get checkups at the Moroboshi Hospital. Symptoms with pictures and everything like that. This is all information that's on page 221, the 42nd article of the maid contract. But you sign it every year without reading. Ah! And there was no point in making a quick recovery! You didn't need to worry in the first place. I wouldn't have gotten turned off or hated you over something like that. Or do you want to stop your agreement with Article 42? But I don't want to be the only maid that you don't track! <laughs> Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here! We'd love to hear your thoughts, too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!